Hello, hello, welcome back to the island. My name is Donald, aka the Scruffy Looking Gamer, and today we are starting with case number two of Wicked Prophecy. We opened up case one, uh, eight boxes worth in a master case. Check out those videos on my channel of case number one. We're going to hit case number two now. We've got eight more boxes in this case to open, and hopefully, case number one two is as good as case number one was because case number one was pretty fantastic if you haven't checked those videos out you probably should it was uh pretty cool hits in there so here is box one case number two there is a lot of air in this box topper a lot of and sealed inside the box topper All right, box topper number one. Anaconda, Anaconda, Anaconda. No shattered glass, just normal old box topper. All right, we got a Hokio oiled. And a Lona. And after my last box, I'm definitely making sure that I check every single one of these common slots. Because there were uh, a couple surprises in the commons in the last box. Another Anaconi. Oiled. And a Licka. I don't think that the uh, the serialized cards, the one of one art cards, all that stuff. I don't think they have a like a guaranteed slot. I think they can just be anywhere. Oil Wyland in a Drakey. I tell you what, my friend Jared and I have been playing some constructed games with the new cards. He put together this commons only uh, ICN deck, and it wrecks. I mean, it is it is really good. It is just commons. So once it's upgraded, like with some rares and nobles, I think I think Pisceans are going to be super fun to play. Skyler foiled, and they do Kraka. Foil Eros. Beautiful artwork on that Eros. Looks great in foil. And Ascension. Foil Bastion of Knowledge. Well, oh, it's a clue, actually. Oil clue. So hard to see on Bastion because of where it's at. Amador. Foil Zaku. And a Kirby. Another foil arrows and eras. Oh, clue non foil clue eras. Sometimes it's hard to see those, especially on the non foils. I feel like the 
the non-foil clues just kind of randomly there. Foil Memento Mori. Really enjoyed the artwork on this one as well. And a Fredonia. Got a foil, foil clue, Camula. Beautiful, beautiful foil. Zokepa. Foil clue, Pluto. Another Zookeppa. Another Foil Memento Mori. And a Kirby. Oil Jurin and an Orpheus. Okay. Struggling. Foil Xyle, Foil Clue Xyle, actually. Still, don't think I've seen a single Noble Rare foil that isn't a clue as well. If you have, please let me know in the comments, because I have yet to see one. Exploit Empathy. I'm not sure if that was intended, but all... Foil Nobles would also be clues. It was an accident. Maybe it's not true. But I have opened eight boxes, almost nine now, and I've yet to see one. Foil Juno. And a Jaterna. Foil Yule Ritual of Winter. And a Riss. Foil Pahuka, Pahuko, Pahuku. And Fredonia. Foil Deep Worship. And Ascension. Foil Clue Amador. Card looks great in foil. And a Kamago. Foil Rhea. 
and a gilia. Oil Invoke Fire and Zolani. Another foil Yule Ritual of Winter. And a Hona. Oil Argus. And a Xyle. Stacks falling over. Oil Clarky. And a Beast Walk. Copy number 72. Oops. How did Clarky get down there? Oil Lorelei. And an Orpheus. Oil Pahuku Star Ritual of Spring So far this box is pretty lackluster Guess they can't all be winners Oil Unmake Another Astara Ritual of Spring. Oil Clue Fervent Incantation. And a Seeds of Tragedy. Cosmic Foil Doubloon. That's pretty sweet. A Foil Lickick. Lick. Like. Like. And Unified by the Code. Foil Ferka and McConaway Foil Mickey. Let's 
Ascension. Foil Nora. Another McConaway. Four packs left. Foil Deep Worship. And Seeds of Tragedy. Foil Clue Amador. Another Makana Way. Got so many of him, and he's a noble rare. Should not be that common. But him and Dukraka, for some reason, I have a ton of. And then I have like four Charlies somehow. Foil Vusho. Zalani. Let me tell you, let me tell you about this card right here. Legendary Voyage. If you're familiar with magic, um, this is essentially in a built correctly Piscean deck. This is Collected Company, uh, but better because you could hit all five, reveal the top five cards. You may put into play all Piscean citizens with a total soul cost three or less from among them, Resco in your limbo. That all-common Piscean deck that I was talking about of Jared's, this card is an all-star. Like, every time, four or five citizens just spit them out onto the, the island. Crazy. If you're playing Piscean, you should probably play that card. I wasn't really sure um, until I saw it used against me. So, it's, it's pretty nuts. Foil Rosa. And a Pluto. All right. Well, that box was a bust. Uh, got a doubloon in Cosmic Foil. A regular old box topper here. And that's it. Those are the hits of that box. So box number one of case number two, not so great. Come back, we'll see box number two. Until next time, we'll see you on the island.